Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you've never been here before, my name's Kristen, what's up? So today, as you can see from the title, I'm going to be showing you guys some of my July favorites. It's just things that I really kept gravitating towards or picking up in the month of July that I just thought I would share with you because I really love them. So anyway, let's just hop on in. I don't have a ton of stuff to show you. I feel like July just flew by. I don't know how we're already in August. That is just so crazy to me. Literally, it's going to be fall and then, you know, Halloween, Thanksgiving, Christmas, and it's New Year's. Like, so fast already. How do we get here? I don't know, but <laughs> let me stop rambling and let me go ahead and jump into the stuff that I have. So first things first, I'm going to show you guys mostly makeup stuff first. I have like one couple hair things, makeup things, and then like one random thing that I just decided to share with, share with you guys. But this first thing I'm showing you is this Morphe uh, continuous setting mist. I am obsessed with this stuff because first of all when you mist your face okay I don't know if you do this but I mist my face a ton and I have to sit there and just <laughs> with this bottle and I cannot stand that so this takes away that part of that work and it just makes it so much easier it smells good too and it's not expensive so that's also a plus but I've just been picking this up constantly since I got it and I'm gonna have to buy a couple more because I'm gonna run out I'm sure the next thing I have that I've really been going towards this month and honestly it's been like the end of the month or last month really because it's already August but last month I picked this up and the first time I used it I fell in love with it this is the Juvia's Place I am magic foundation this is a really thick full coverage foundation and I seriously found it like the perfect color for me this is 140 I think it's Angola I might be saying that wrong I don't know I didn't look up how I'm supposed to pronounce it before I started this video but this foundation is awesome and I've literally used it every day since I started using it and I have not put it down yet so I thought I'd mention that in this because even though I did start using it at the end of the month I am obsessed and I will continue to use it this like this month I'm, I have ordered the concealer so I'm gonna try those and I hope they're as good as this foundation is so the next thing, I just wanted to show you guys the mascaras that I've been like loving. I go through mascaras like crazy because for some reason my eyes are really, really sensitive when it comes to mascaras and I have to switch them out like every two months. But the ones that I've been loving lately are Urban Decay Perversion. And then I've also been using like the Urban Decay Subversion. Uh, before that this is the eyelash primer this makes my eyelashes pop like these two things together but I've also just been using this primer with other um, mascaras that I have and this uh, ColourPop volumizing mascara is honestly like an affordable top favorite like this stuff is amazing like this literally is my BFF like <laughs> on the back of this lashes chick but seriously I love this stuff it's so awesome and I'm all about some lashes. So the next thing that I've been like legit, like I'm, I, these, I have to buy like 12 pair of these, maybe more, <laughs> but, but these Lily Lashes and Mykonos, I've been obsessed with them this entire month. This is pretty much, right now I'm not wearing them, obviously. I don't know why I'm not wearing them, but this month I've legitimately been obsessed with these Mykonos lashes. Right now I am wearing Lily Lashes, but these are the Miami ones. These though, oh my gosh, I just love these on me. They're so thick and they just like make every look just look amazing. I've, so I've been wearing these every month, so I thought I'd mention those too. The next thing, like you guys have seen this in a couple of videos, but when I say I wear this every day, it's a complete understatement. Like literally every time I put makeup on or just like do my brows if I even do my brows I put this on even with no makeup on but this is the Urban Decay 24 7 glide on pencil in 1993 and then also the gloss the hi-fi shine gloss in 1993 
this is like my go-to nude look for anything and I've been wearing it for like the past two months but I haven't done a favorites video until now but <laughs> I had to throw this in there though because I just love this color on me and I've literally been wearing it so much it's crazy next thing that I'm showing you guys is the fourth ray beauty face milk these things I don't know honestly what is in these or what I've been doing with my life before I had these in them because they make my skin feel so good and they smell so good. I just so am in love with these. I use these like before I do my makeup. I use them before I go to bed. Like I put them on all the time. They smell so good and like I said, they make my skin feel amazing. They're not like sticky. They're not oily. They're just like the perfect amount of moisture that you need before you put on your, I do put on a moisturizer after I use these, but they're just a perfect amount of moisture that you need to just give it an extra, mm, you know what I mean? Like these are, these are bomb. These are bomb. I just love them. So that's all the stuff that I have for makeup. I'm going to go ahead and move on to hair. Like I said, I don't have a ton of favorites this month. I just was like, you know what? I really love favorites videos, so I'm going to film a favorites video. I've never done one before. Let's do it. So for hair stuff, though, I know this is an oldie but goodie and something that I always recommend to people. This is Kinky Curly Not Today. I stopped using that. You can see this is a brand new bottle. Like I stopped using this and picked it up a couple weeks ago and I don't know why I stopped using it. I, was, I, I put it in my hair and I put it in the kid's hair and I was just like, what have I been doing? I've been trying other stuff because I can't not, not just see I find something I like and I'm like oh I do like this and then I'm like but let's try so I constantly have to try other things and you know I always 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 go back to this but this month I've been using this constantly uh Callie my daughter has been in swim lessons so I've had to wash her hair almost every day this has been a lifesaver because she does not like to get her hair combed and when I put this in there no tears no nothing we're good <laughs> so like it, it, if you have any kind of wave any kind of curl any kind of even if you have straight I guess straight hair I don't know if it works on straight hair honestly I don't know but it's just bomb and you got to get it if you got any kind of like wave or curl or anything to your hair if your hair knots up this stuff will just right through okay comb it right on through and it'll be fine I promise this is awesome okay so the next thing I've been using like super heavily this month for my hair is this golden hot look at this thing it's like it's just a tiny uh overhead dryer like it's so I know it looks it looks like a little briefcase dee, 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 dee. but it's not a briefcase so you open up let me put that down so you open up this little part right here and it has the cord in there if you've never seen this before this is pretty cool because my hair takes I don't know how long way too long to dry because it's so thick it takes forever so I put doing my hair off as long as possible this thing has made it so much easier because now I can you know wash my hair braid it because I usually do a twist out or braid out or something like that braid it put this on my head it takes about an hour and a half it's, it does take a long time but it's so small and compact that it really doesn't bother me it is loud so you know you can't I mean you can watch tv but you gotta put the subtitles on but <laughs> so it is loud but anyway after you open this little bitty compartment right here this little thing comes out this has a tiny little hole in the back of it right here and this right here is the little hose you just twist twist right here because if you and then you pull the little hose out connect this to the hose plug it in turn it on cool low medium high put it on medium I know like if you're worried about heat damage you can put it on cool but it's gonna take forever and the whole reason why I got it is to speed up I mean if I put it on cool it still speed it up more than it, it does in the first place but honestly I'm just impatient and I put it on medium 
and let it go, let it run, and ta-da! So <laughs> this thing has been a lifesaver. I just got it this month and it has been a holy grail staple for me right now because I honestly, um, I just don't like to wait for my hair to dry. I just don't want to wait for it. It's so thick, it's so long that I just don't want to wait. And so this has been a lifesaver. Okay, so the last thing that I'm going to show you guys today has nothing to do with beauty whatsoever, but I have legit been using this thing like every single day. Every single day. It never fails. I will use it, okay? <laughs> because I drink tea every single day to wake me up. So if you drink coffee or tea or any kind of hot beverage, I recommend this thing right here. It's called an ember. This is my ember mug. Say hello to my ember mug. It is freaking awesome. So what you do with this thing, it is an electric mug. So it is gonna keep your beverage hot. You plug it in and it has a little saucer. This is where it charges. So you plug it in, let it charge overnight and then uh, you use your phone it has an app that goes with it you can set it to whatever temp that you want it has like a tea timer on it and it the alert comes to your phone the alert even comes to your phone when it's the right temperature for you and like it's just awesome because i'm not gonna lie in the mornings they kind of get a little hectic with the kids and i forget i completely forget that i made tea so you know before i got this thing it would just be cold I <laughs> just I would just have cold tea and I wouldn't want to make another one because I have had it where I've made two and it's turned into two cold teas and then I just give up on life that day. <laughs> so, but this thing has made a complete difference in my life. Like, oh my god. No, I'm just kidding. Like it but it really works and it works so well. Um the only thing I have to really complain about it honestly, the if you I don't know how long you need your beverage hot after about an hour then that's when I remember I had tea this thing usually dies in about two and a half to maybe three hours if I'm lucky so um, after two hours you're not supposed to get this wet so I guess you could stick it back on the base if you wanted it to charge while you still want hot a hot drink just make sure the bottom is not wet I guess you could do that but honestly, um, the two hour mark is pretty good for me. That's when I finally have gotten them settled, me settled, and then I'm like, oh, my tea. So, <laughs> so I've been using this like constantly and I love it. <laughs> So anyway, that's it for my favorites, you guys. Um, let me know in the comments or give me a thumbs up if you like these kind of videos. And I can let you guys know the things that I'm using this month that I've been picking up constantly that I really, really like. And I mean, you know, I will see you in the next video. Make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you like it. Make sure you comment, all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.